year we experienced a very bizarre phase which was confinement and many things were uh, in a in a very different went into a very different phase and i was already working on a project about domestic violence and since we got into the confinement uh, the number of cases started going up and to know that some women who suffer domestic violence and who do not feel safe inside their own home what would it be like for them to be stuck in 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 four walls with a person who is abusive so i started continuing uh, in my head how i wanted to take my project of feminicide uh, forward i covered the the march which happened in november um and then i did some interviews and some photographs of the families of the victims of the women who died this photography project of mine is about keeping this debate alive we've lost many women but we can keep the debate alive it's important to keep talking about it it's like a tribute to all those women that we have lost so with this exhibition i called for um, through the atelier called some uh, volunteers and it was a conceptual shoot very different from journalistic work of mine and they they came with this knowledge that it's about domestic violence and so we worked with a makeup artist and she recreated some of the wounds which were from the reported cases of domestic violence and through these photographs which are at um, a, a part of the festival it's to for people to see to bring those women really up front in front of your face to see what they go through with all the bruises on their face because generally we hide them we put makeup on them or we put big glasses on around our eyes so nobody sees the the punch mark on your face but with these photographs we we want to put it out in the open look this is what ha happens to to women